spectacular Burj Khalifa. The tallest building in the world is not only one of the most famous tourist attractions in Dubai, but also it houses one of the most luxurious hotels in Dubai, the Armani Hotel. The hotel is famous for one of the finest Indian restaurants in Dubai, the Armani Amal. It not only offers innovative regional Indian cuisine, but you can also enjoy there a breathtaking show of sights and sounds of the Dubai Fountain. In the a la carte menu in Armani Amal, all vegan dishes are clearly marked. However, we decided to try a tasting menu which was transformed by the chef into a vegan menu especially for us. Welcome to Armani Amal. Since the very beginning, the restaurant entrance lobby moves you to a fairy tale world of exquisite Indian cuisine. The restaurant offers elegant interior seating overlooking the glass kitchen, so you can watch the chefs at work. to sit outside, to admire the Burj Khalifa light show from the below and to enjoy the greatest fountain show in the world, without the mass of tourists obstructing the view. The Dubai Fountain is a choreographed fountain system located on the enormous 12-hectare man-made Burj Khalifa lake, at the center of the downtown Dubai development. The fountain is animated with performance set to light and music. It is visible from every point on the lake promenade and from many neighboring structures. Performance take place every 30 minutes from 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. on weekdays and from 6 p.m. to 11 p.m. on weekends. Travelers, we are a vegan family and we love traveling in style. There is me, Gosia, my husband, Piotr, and our son, Adam. Before we go to the food review, I will share with you our trick, how we managed to survive a fine dining experience with our four years old son. We prepared for Adam a surprise bag with different activities. He found there, for example, water coloring, crayons, and a notebook for drawing that kept him entertained while waiting for our order. First, a healthy lentils and veggie soup for Adam was served. It wasn't in the menu, but the chef prepared it specially for our son. Okay, let's start our foodies experience. So this is your appetizer, it's all a vegan plate. On the right top, we have mixed vegetable sheet kebab, which is right here. So with some salad. It's basically made of a lot of different vegetables, binded together with some potatoes, cooked in the skewers in the tandoor. Beneath that, we have alu tikki cha. This is basically a potato patty, which is deep fried. And then on top of that, you can see some yolk, uh, the tamarind sauce. That's crispy fried potatoes and some chickpeas. Underneath the sauce is coriander sauce. Towards the left, we have broccoli. It has a bhatti marination, which is with red chilies and a little bit more spicier size uh, side, and then it's cooked in tandoor, also in the clay in oven. In tandoor? Yeah. Oh, that's nice. And then we have it here, kale. So this was the uh, broccoli, okay. That's, that's the broccoli okay. with tamarind sauce on the side. This here we have kale patty. It's made of kale. Usually we serve it with a cheese stuffing in it, but because it is a vegan one, so we have removed that. And then on top of that, you have some tamarind sauce and some edamame beans. Uh, it has semolina uh, to bind it together because kale on its own is like very soft. Yeah. It's really nice and has a very subtle taste, uh, uh, earthy taste to it. Please enjoy it. Thank you very Thank much. You. You're welcome. Thank you. Wow, it's spicy. Like proper Indian food. It's very spicy. There are some veggies, 
It smells like a veggies. Yes, veggies. It's like pate from veggies with, with Indian spices. Pate? Yes. Yeah. You want to try? It's no. Spicy. It's very yeah. spicy, but it, it's, there's a nice taste of cumin, curry, and some other spices that I don't really know, but. So now this a bit sweet, sweetish, some crispy Indian, well, Indian snacks, very crispy and spicy, and this I think coriander cilantro. Mm. Very rich taste. A bit sweet, a bit spicy, soft, structure, very good. And this is tandoori broccoli. I'm very curious about this one because I love tandoori taste. Might be spicy. Yeah, it might be spicy. You see, it's spicy. Okay. Very spicy. Oh my goodness. All right. <laughs> Mommy, this is spicy. This way. This no, but the broccoli is very spicy. Oh wow, it's already spicy. It's like explosion of spice. But also, you can see, taste this um, typical tandoori taste, aroma. Mm. It's good, but it's really spicy. I, I still feel it. I need some water. <laughs> I need some water. <laughs> oh, but it's good. It's good spice. <laughs> Now it's time for the main course. It consisted from four different dishes perfectly served by the well-trained staff. Sag Miloni, this is a vegetable with spinach, and this is a broccoli as well as puriel, some modern South Indian dish, and this is a baby potatoes, some baby spicy sauce, and the other yellow lentil, and the other Dutch here, some rice as well. Thank you. The restaurant was very kids friendly. Even when Adam was playing with his food, causing a little mess, the staff was very understanding. It's really a great place for a family fine dining experience. Okay, the main course is finished. It's time for dessert. Happy day, day. Happy day, day for daddy. Happy day, day for you. Thank you. Oh, you can love it. Woo. Thank you very much. We were served a saffron panna cotta with forest berries marmalade and white berry sorbet, decorated with a golden leaf. Armani Amal is a true fine dining experience with mouth-watering food and very friendly professional staff. When you are in Dubai, remember not to miss it. <laughs>